Welcome. So this one is um, Shooting Star. This is a variation or the next stage on from the Twinkling Star that we just did. Um, the star position is exactly the same. So we're having the student to lie on the floor. We have the uh, head facing towards the right on the floor with the thumb facing towards the face in a twinkling motion. Uh, the leg up in 90 degrees, uh, thigh out and then leg down. Uh, left side of the body straight, arm straight in a fist motion. Uh, and the only changes with this one is instead of just doing the change, we're actually going to try and move the student forward on the floor. Now, it's a very difficult motion and often uh, the practitioner will stand behind the student um, with their foot behind the student's uh, 90 degree leg to help propel them forward um, so they can move uh, across the room, building up to about sort of five minutes of doing this. So um, I'll just work my way quietly up here, all being well. I've got nothing behind me, but I'll give it my best shot uh, moving forward. So as I said, same start position with the twinkling. And we're going to forward. Okay, this is a twinkling star. Um, so we get the student to lie on the floor and uh, head to the right hand side and they're having their hand flat on the floor uh, with their thumb facing towards their face. Uh, fingers out at the twinkling, we get them to twinkle it. And the right leg comes up at 90 degrees on the floor with the thigh and that's sort of out. And then the left hand side is um, in a straight line with the fist and then in a gentle movement we turn the head to the opposite direction we bring the left hand up holding onto the floor or sort of touching the floor until that's in the twinkling motion and the right hand moves down and as it goes down it moves into the fist alongside so I'll do a couple of examples of that just on the floor so we're going from the start position which is straight there and then we're just going to move across. And that's in the twinkling position. And we can move the twinkle around as well at the same time. And then we move it across. Okay, our um, next one is um, 18, uh, which is a type of continuous uh, form drawing, drawing uh, that we do with the students. Um, again, we're, you, well, we're going to use two uh, blocks of crayons and we're going to use the uh, daddy side, which is the, the long side on both. Um, we're looking for the student to have a, a straight back, uh, feet nicely positioned. Uh, on the floor, so they're straight and they're direct in front of the sheet. Uh, we're looking for all four fingers uh, to be on the, the crayon. Uh, and we're looking for, to start off with, we're looking for the uh, left to be doing the one up and down, and we're looking for the right to be moving with the eight. So we want them filling the paper, if possible, with a gap between the one and the eight. Um, can go on every five or six minutes. I'm going to do it for about a minute. Uh, another way of doing it is in the last um, 30 seconds or so, we can also close the eyes and get the student to uh, try and do it blind for the 30 seconds. Um, so, yeah, so um, uh, I'll give us a go to, uh, to kick it off.
So I'll just talk while I'm doing it and just in terms of doing this, um, in the first couple of weeks uh, we wouldn't necessarily be changing the uh, aspect of the eight in terms of the student, but uh, as maybe two weeks had gone on we would be looking to um, move uh, the eight into the direction that we're looking for in terms of it. Um, in the other way, uh, towards the end of it, uh, an alternative as well in terms of it is to move to 81, which is that again with the daddy side of the ground was to have the students um, do an eight on the left hand side and uh, a one on the right hand side. And again, we'll be looking for the right in that instance to be moving in the opposite direction. So I think that's about a minute. Shut the video asked for. I'll show. I've been talking a lot. It's not as perfect as I like, but I'll just show you what, in terms of what I've done. I'll just pull the salad thing up. Oh. And there's the 18. So we've got the 8. One's a bit thick. I'm still learning. <laughs> um, so yeah, so there's uh, 18.